Hi everybody, here's Linda with Timbird Studios. Just wanted to stop by and show you some of the stuff I uh, purchased this week. And these are all uh, a mix of um, online purchases. And the first one is a subscription box. And this is so sample, so sampler, and many of you have probably already seen most of the contents, but I thought I'd go through it anyway. And uh, so this is for March, 2024. And I'll go ahead and take these things out one at a time. Put the fabric there. And okay. All right. So those are all the items. And um, I do enjoy their subscription boxes. And so this is Spring Memories, March 2024. And so what it contains is a, a fat eight bundle, three quarter half square triangle, triangle paper, foundation piecing, water pen and tweezers, spring flags quilt pattern. And then it also has, um, a zip zipper charm and uh, pressed flowers quilt along so um, really nice deal I think um, so this is my first one of these so that's really cool I like the colors and this is the finishing for the quilt along and then another pattern so I'll add that to my collection of patterns. And then it's got a quilt pattern, which these are always fun. And this seems like it's pretty easy. So excited about that. And um, what do we have here? Okay, a water pen. So I'll open this up. Okay. So I've just ordered some tweezers, which you'll see in my other, uh, the other purchase I made. But I don't think you can ever have too many of these. So these are really nice. Let's take it out. Okay. Really nice. Really feel good. Okay. Carolina Moore. Okay. Awesome. And then a water pen. Let's open this up and see what it looks like. Okay. All right. So open. Let's see if I can open this up. No, maybe I have got to go this way. Oh, there we go. Okay, so you open up this way. I guess you got the water there. There we go. And I hope it didn't mess this up. Okay. We'll have to look at that a little bit more slowly, but that would be the water pen. There we go. Okay. And then, finally, well, almost, we've got these um, half square triangles, and I'm not uh, familiar how to use these, so if any of you know of a good um, channel to watch regarding these, let me know. Some tutorial. Made in the USA. Cool. All right, and then we've got the fabric. And I believe it's Holly Schmidt. She does a lot of unboxings. And uh, she was able to show um, these fabrics. And so she has a really, really uh, nice channel. Okay, so let's go ahead and set these aside. And bring these out. Okay. 
Okay. This looks really, really cool. Very nice. Got one that's similar in pattern. And this has kind of that patriotic vibe, so that's that'll be nice to use. This is fun. There we go. Right side up. Some bunting. In there. Got this little bit of whimsy. Subtle teal. And um, I've got a small quilt that I bought. It's actually a runner. And here and there has little spots of text. So um, these can be a lot of fun to add to your designs, to your patterns. That looks very retro. Got some numbers. So, I'm not sure if I would use these last two with the rest of the design, but um, they are very pretty. I mean, it could, I guess it could mix together well depending on the pattern. But yeah, these are the fabrics. So that's so sampler for March 2024. Okay. All right. So let's move on. And this is uh, from another package here. And this is from Green Fairy Quilts. And so I'll just go ahead and take these out. some fun things that I saw and they've got a lot of specials um, so I believe all these were on special or on sale okay uh, okay uh, let's see hmm it's kind of to get to. There we go. Need to cut that. Need to cut this here. Okay, there we go. That's better. Okay, and even though it's past the, you know, Valentine's Day, I don't mind. I thought the print was cute. So was able to get um, some charm squares and then a layer cake so um, I picked this up because um, my brother was in FFA uh, when he was in high school and I just thought um, if ever I wanted to make a quilt uh, in remembrance of him um, I could include this fabric and then there's All My Heart, it's Valentine's Day theme. And then uh, White as Snow. So let's go ahead and start with White as Snow. Okay, and I'll open this up. Take this off camera here. And I'm gonna Go 
Why does it seem so difficult to do this when we're getting in front of the camera? Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and grab something real quick. And I'll just set, set this here so you can look at those patterns while I do that. So the reason I bought um, this layer cake, I had already purchased one. And I really liked the fabric. Um, and it's for a project that I'll be working on. And I thought, I'm not going to have enough uh, material, so um, I better order another one. Okay, there we go. Okay, set that aside. And so here we go. And so I love the quotes um, in this first um, pattern, in this first fabric, excuse me. Um, they always include a little pen. So this is from Green Fairy Quilts. And let's see. Well, that might have been the pen. Yeah, I think so. Okay. So, um, so we'll go ahead and go through this. This is so cute. I'll just go quickly through this so you can look at all the patterns. But I think it has a nice mix of color. And um, I love the print. And so I'm really looking forward to see this one's a little bit flatter, so it's much better, much easier to appreciate. Just lovely, lovely designs, I think. I love this one. The snow. A lot of stripes. A lot of text. That's beautiful, too. I love this, too. That red background with a white print. Very pretty. So um, I think this is quite a bit to work with now that I have two of these and I'm glad I purchased this one. Alright, that's really Okay, lovely. Just gorgeous, gorgeous patterns. Okay, and again, this one is um, White as Snow, Riley Blake Designs. And it's got the designer there, fresh. Okay, so that's one, one pack. Let's go ahead and move on to the other one. Okay, this is all my heart. I haven't seen this one, so this is the, the different prints. This video might be a little bit longer than the ones I usually post because I want to be able to share the different patterns with you. Okay. Oh, that's super cute. 
you know, just the graphics are really, really nice. This reminds me of um, Mary Inglewright a little bit. The one we just looked at. Oh, this is cute. Oh, again. With the sentiments. Really lovely. That's gorgeous there. And so this has also a lot of that same color combination with the the red, the white. And I'm wondering if I can at any point, if I've got some left over from one project, mix it up with another one. So lovely. Oh, cool. Make sure you can see everything here. Some more sentiments. These look like, um, um, like reproductions from um, 1920s as far as the imagery. That's fun. Take a better look at that one. Super, super fun. So, I'm glad I got this one. And, uh, like I said, many were on, uh, all the ones I got were on sale. And so, uh, just really, really lovely. Okay? So, that's another charm pack. And again, that's all my heart. And... Uh, Riley Blake Designs. And you've got the designer there at the bottom. Okay. Here's the rest of the information. Okay. And then... I got one more. This, is, this one has fewer patterns. So it's going to repeat the same ones uh, several times. This is a classic FFA original Ferrara Blue since 1928. Refreshed. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and go through this. Yeah, so it's got, I think it's got uh, the same print, several of the same print, um, all at one, in one section. Okay. It's got that farmhouse feel to it. Okay, I like that. Yeah, so I just... I just like the imagery and the, you know, the, just the graphic of the design of the emblem. It brings back good memories. And this one with a gray background. Kind of like between a taupe and a gray. Here you've got a gray background. Okay. Alright, so again, that is, uh, again, Riley Blake, FFA Original, Forever Blue. Okay, so now we're going to move on to the last package. And this is from Smile Mercantile. And, and I have a video that I, in which I used um, some of the tinsel garland uh, for a project. So let's go ahead and open this up. 
Oh, and I also purchased these tweezers. So I've got two sets of tweezers. Okay, so this is from Smile Mercantile Crap Company. I'm going to go ahead and oops, open this. Pull the things out. There's just a couple of items from this. And they wrap everything pretty carefully. Okay, so this is one of the items. And this is the other item. Okay, and then, yeah, that's it. Okay, so um, these are just simply some deer miniatures. Uh, and I thought these would be great to create uh, different vignettes small in small shadow boxes. And then these are uh, some spun cotton. And these are um, a mix. There's a, uh, an amount of, of 50. And they come in all different sizes. 